welcome to Three Crazy Hounds. So this is episode number two in my series. And today I'm introducing you to Brandy. She is a lemon beagle. She's four years old. Uh, we rescued her about four years ago. And she is all ears and noise. So she's such a really good girl. She is a really good size for her, uh, for her size and her sex, about 30, uh, 32 pounds. And if you have a beagle, raise your hands if you have a beagle. Okay, there you go, I see you. Oh, uh, it is tough to keep that weight off. So I definitely recommend to uh, stick with the size of food and kibble that your veterinarian re rep recommends. Oh, uh, and uh, constant exercise, frequent exercises and play. And of course, I know she shows a little bit of a Michelin belly here, but she is doing very well. She is healthy for her age. Oh, and a couple of her characteristics. She is one big snuggle bug. Oh, she is happy to meet people. Oh, her temperament is extremely friendly and very loving. So if you are thinking about getting a beagle, oh, as a first time dog owner, definitely do your research. Oh, you will find that they are, you would think they are stubborn, but they're very independent as most hounds are. Though they are pack animals, they are meant to go out hunting, sniffing, and they can be a lot of fun and also very frustrating. Uh, so again, I highly recommend to do your research. Oh, uh, and she is absolutely perfect. So another piece I'm going to do in just a moment is gonna be leashes and harnesses for a beagle. Again, raise your hands if you are a beagle owner. Is your beagle a Houdini dog? Yep, same here. So we're gonna cover that in just a moment. Hang tight. Mando. Come here. Okay, we are going to discuss leashes. They are for you and your dog's safety and for those all around you. To have fun and a healthy human and hound relationship, it is important to find your best fit. I'm going to show you our two favorites. A bungee style leash to walk one dog at a time and the split or Y style leash to walk two at a time. The single bungee style is great to walk one dog. Ideal for suburban areas if you're just walking to the mailbox. Just the right amount of length. I like to use the bungee style when I take Willow on our 5Ks. Next, the split leads. Great to walk two dogs at once. It will keep you from getting wrapped and tangled up. It will take some getting used to. I like to use this when I'm training my new dog to walk with another dog. And a great tip, keep that Y pointing at you. Hey, we're back. All right, we are gonna be covering harnesses for your hound. Oh, and I have a couple of oldies and goodies. I have a eh, not so much, and a new wow. So I'm gonna go over my oldie but goodie, and this brand is Kong, and I know you all like the chews, and the squeaky balls, and the Kong, they stand up to the test of time. So this particular harness, oh, got the very strong D-ring on the back. Oh, it goes through the neck, and that is adjustable. And this goes around the waist, which is adjustable. I'm sorry, not the waist, but the chest right up here. Uh, and the reason the chest uh, harnesses are so much better. Hi, Willow. Hi there. There you go. Why these work out so much better than a regular traditional collar. Oh, uh, your dog is walking. Your dog is walking. They see a squirrel. They see a cat. They see something that they really want to get to. And then they pull. This is going to pull on their chest and they pull back and they are redirected on the neck it is going to cut, keep on going and it's no fun for you or for the dog not a good situation so the kong again durable machine washable and my all-time uh, go-to my eh, middle of the road one this is kurgo oh i bought this one at petco and so it has two different hooks so you can do the top hook and you can do a front hook so the only reason I would not recommend this one for beagles, because they are Houdinis. 
And yes, if you have your Houdini dog, show of hands, mine was able to get out of this one many times to get after a kitty cat. So again, they're kind of cute, oh, um, but not worth, um, not worth the hassle. Oh, my next one, my third one, uh, which I, my, my new wow, this is called Ready by Petco as well. So nice and strong. These buckles are very durable. Again, easily adjustable for the chest and around the neck. Okay, and that goes around the chest. And you got the six pack right on top. Okay, and if you would need to do a front lead, you got the right, you got the D hook up here. So this one is for my basset. And since the other day my beagle decided to escape, she got herself a matching one. So again, all these harnesses are very helpful. Uh, what I would uh, recommend, you can try out the Kong, Handy Dandy, great price mark. Gergo, eh, a little too high in price my, on my taste. Ready, um, again, that is a Petco brand. I, I'm gonna go with those um, if I can't find myself a Kong. Oh, uh, do your research when you're at Petco or another store. Oh, uh, ask other puppy parents. Oh, what are they using? What did they use? What was successful? Oh, uh, again, thank you so very much for stopping by today. You can follow me on Instagram, on Twitter, YouTube. Like, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye.